You voted for a cat cafe, so I made you a cat cafe. Hey, my name is Tara and I'm building in Brindleton Bay this time. Uh, you wanted me to make a cat cafe and I thought that was a really good idea. Here yeah, I'm just freestyling a bit for the outside. I looked up some cat cafes on the on Pinterest but they were all buildings between other buildings and pretty small so I thought I would just uh, just made something <laughs> that uh, yes, I think it, uh, it came out pretty well the whole building is a base game and get cats and dogs no other packs just uh, so you can download it if you want my username on the gallery is Tara Watson no space here I'm working on the outside. This is the back side of the building where you sense can uh, put the trash. A nice entryway. I like those windows. They came with uh, with cats and dogs, and I like that they match the uh, the door and the fence. It's just uh, make uh, make this a bit cohesive. I'm putting some flower boxes outside, just liven it up, and a thing above the doorway so you uh, keep dry when you enter the building and I'm placing some kind of shingles on the outside I don't know exactly what it is but it looks nice so <laughs> that's that and uh, I'm placing a bit of greenery on top uh, of the bump out of the roof there I thought about making a bit more of a uh, of making the balcony a bit bigger but I thought this this looked uh, nicer now going to the inside now I'm placing the stairs and something happened that never happens to me it just plopped down at the exact right space it couldn't be any better it just fits perfectly in the top here at the top um, I am making the bathroom it just seemed like the perfect place for it. It's just this build, it just fell into place. I don't know what it was. But I, I, I really like it. I use a lot of cats and dogs stuff. Also for the bathroom, the, uh, the sinks, the toilets are all cats and dogs. I believe the mirror is base game. Um, yeah, uh, keeping it really, really simple. Just toilets with toilet paper, sinks and a mirror. Uh, so yeah. Uh, your sims can take care of their needs. Some small cats and dogs windows on top of the toilets to make it look a bit better. Uh, this flooring and I believe the wallpaper too is from cats and dogs. I wanted a bit of an outside seating area for your sims to sit. This top floor will be a bit of a working area for your sims. I'm gonna place computers there and such but first we're going to the down oh yes I just realized I couldn't make a cafe because that is part of the get together expansion and I just wanted to keep a base game in cats and dogs so it is a cafe uh, not a cafe a bar so yeah now I'm uh, I have made sure uh, sure I have everything a bar needs so I don't need to worry about that again this is the bar area. I am placing a coffee machine and some decorations. Uh, a thing with mugs on it, which looked pretty nice. The cats and dog fireplace, which is so pretty. And then I realized those couches and chairs match the curtains. It, it It's not my favorite swatch, but for some reason it really, <laughs> really fit in here. And so I just, uh, just went for it some litter boxes and feeding thingies for your for the cats that are here i made it a, um, a cat hangout and some other cat thing uh for for the um the lot rates so cats will come here and owners will come with their cats to hang out here they're placing lots and lots of scratching posts and stuff for the cats to play on. Some chair, some uh, stools for your sims to sit and play on with the cats. And I place those shelves so you can... Uh, I, I will place cat treats there. A fish tank which the cats will find pretty interesting of course. <laughs> the top lid is on so they can't hurt the fish. 
in case you were concerned of that a sign outside with a pet and a coffee thing on it so you know what to expect when you go inside and some toys for your uh, for your cats and just putting down lots and lots of decorations i really like those uh, planters those cats and those dogs with uh, with plant in them succulents i think they are and here i am going to clutter up the shelves i now realize there isn't much much room on the shelf so i'm using the red shelf to clutter it up some things do slot on there like the the cookie jar slots on it but most of the stuff doesn't oh and these these cats do slot on, uh, on it i think they specifically made those shells for those cats it, it looks like it they fit that uh, they're so perfectly and livening it up with some more flowers like always i didn't forget a trash bin and uh, later i am realizing the door beneath the stairs doesn't work in functional so i will replace it of replace it i will move it oh yes here will be the desks with the computers on it so your sims can do a little bit of work if they want to but of course it's still very cat friendly there will be lots of cat trees but i do like the idea of your sims being able to work on their skills when they are visiting a lot yeah and two more cat trees there and bookcases for your sims to uh, to read some more litter boxes i really like those litter boxes there will be l laser beams come uh, out of the those cats eyes to uh, obliterate the, the waste <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, i think it's really funny the sims thing did a good job with that placing some more of those really, really cute planters and some more cat treats on the desks so while you're working at at the computer you can still uh, feed the cats and play with them and now i'm going wild with the decorations i thought the begin of the entrance here looked a bit barren so i'm placing some cat balls there to uh, towards the bar and uh, of course we have a fireplace so we do need a chimney and now there's a bit of terrain paint to make it uh, make it look pretty going uh, in with the final touches the back entrance with the trash cans i will place some feet there and now we are going into the screenshots i really really enjoyed making this build i have put up a new poll for you to decide what i am going to build next i love to hear your suggestions if you have any other idea please leave them down in the comments and i post new videos every day so i hope to see you tomorrow bye bye